pipe, so we make two jigs, the Lindy jig and the Lindy live bait jig. What's the difference? When do I use them? Why? I'm gonna tell you right now. We're gonna start out with the Lindy jig. This jig has been around forever. Um, I'm gonna use this jig if I'm pitching, casting, flipping, anything like that. Um, plastics, I love putting plastics on this jig. It's got two little bumps there, bait keepers, that will hold that plastic on there nicely. Big protruded eyes, always has a clean eyelet. Flipping, pitching, casting, anything like that. I do also vertical jig this jig a lot. Um, I will put live bait on it if I'm up in Canada. I absolutely love putting live bait on this and casting, flipping it, banging it off the rocks up in Canada. Great presentation. Second jig I'm gonna talk about is the Lindy live bait jig. All right, this jig is specifically designed for live bait by Jeff Sundin. Um, it has a short shank, wide gap, um, it's more of a horizontal presentation. The fish comes up from behind, boom, you get a nice hook set right on it like that, generally top of the mouth. This jig, I would slow drig, jig drift it or I would vertical jig it. Um, both of these jigs, I wouldn't be afraid to put live bait on either of these jigs. They're great, great live bait jig. Sometimes in walleye fishing, um, the little subtlest difference um, can make the walleyes bite. So if one jig isn't really producing that much, switch to the other jig. You'd be surprised by just switching the jig and a little bit of a difference in action between the two jigs can make all the difference.